The practice of learning has waned considerably in England since the days of the Romans. What books they still have, they keep locked away in their churches, hidden from the eyes of common folk. Thralls and shells cannot read. What would be the point? They could learn. The church could teach them. So much of human history would be open to them. Aristotle, Pythagoras, Euclid, ancient knowledge lost to all but a few hard-headed men of the cloth. You have studied these works yourself. In my youth, I was consumed with a passion for understanding. I spent many hours a day in the House of Wisdom in Baghdad. A seminary. A great library, full of the greatest learning of mankind. For a boy seeking answers, it holds many riches. One day, I was sitting cross-legged, devouring a study by the great astronomer al Khwarizmi. With the swiftness belying his years, the papers were plucked from my grasp by the great man himself. His presence stole my voice. He was kind and open-hearted. He showed me such scientific wonders. And what did you learn there? Calendars and calculations placing the sun, moon, and five planets. Equations! That's enough! 